Apex, the peak of South African motoring. Jules, yeah, play, go, quiz me. Okay, on your marks, get it, go. What color car are we driving? Mid blue. Mid, mid blue. Mid, it's like, like a band. Mid it's got this name. <laughs> They're a rock band. Yeah. It's one word. It starts with the M for mother. Mid blue midnight. Mid blue. What? Band? So like, think of a band. It's a rock band. Right. Okay. Their band starts with the letter M. Metallica. Okay. Oh, mid blue metallic. Hey. Yeah. Thirty seconds. Maybe not so great. Five tachrankis for you. Okay. So we have got a V6 three liter. And what uh, fuel goes in here? <laughs> Diesel. Okay. Do you, do you know that our fuel consumption is sitting at 12.6 liters? <laughs> um, oh, I have to comment on the refinement. I find it, it's a bloody refined cocktail, right? It's one thing that I have always loved about Amarok is that it doesn't feel like a bucky. And even though we're now in Ranger vibes, they've Ranger County somehow maintained that sort of more of a car feel than an industrial backy feeling. Yeah. Did you just say backy? Yeah, love me a backy. You love your backy, my <gasps> boo. I actually hate a backy. I know I, you hate a backy. Mm, you know how practical a backy is? Only if you're on a farm. It is not practical only when you want to do it. Never. Are you kidding me? There's so much space back there. No, there's not. Back what I do it, when you put your groceries on the loading bay, now I'm a sort of into it to go and get them they roll around but maybe this Can't thing's got a divider we can find out divide and conquer oh here we go yeah, Ooh, yeah this is really, everything's going i don't know where this number oh, no. <laughs> i'm also i'm not going on the only thing i'm going um look i i love a bucky i'm a bucky kind of gal kind of a refined yeah and there is a lot of like little secret stowaway section oh that was very loud um like a water bottle space in the door you would like to think like there'd be space for like a one liter or two liter oh, no it's not it's tiny only space for my chippings i also don't love that the climate control i hate this, this is not you know exclusive to amarok or anybody but when it's in the screen it's complicated. Oh, I just, I just want to be able to turn it on, turn it off as quick as possible. Do you know how many times I almost used the volume button to Yes. Like, just wanted to crank up the... Correct. You get in, it's 36 yeah. degrees outside. You're like, no, I'm going to sit and wait. No, I must go through the screen. Quite nope. aggressive. Um, but I like it. And I like like the multi-surfaces. I love a multi-surface. If it's like what? plasticky see? vibes, then you go into like something that's like a little Metallica vibe. A little leather I, over here. Um, I like it not at all interested at what's on a dashboard when anybody says like any journals right and they're like you know the materials are a bit plasticky and like you know the dashboard i'm like how often do you touch your dashboard i do what okay well that's weird i know do dashboard. you like just caress your dashboard every now and then and especially like these little shiny ones which other german cars do like you see dirt and dog hair and cuck so easily on there uh, on this like here's one dog here and it comes from either archie or harry or george <laughs> i'm in the fancy pants one right we're not in the amarok yeah. there's the amarok and then it's like life la di da di da di da so we've got the style the, like, aventura or something yeah the aventura or aventura is that like there's an a at the end like aventura yeah this is like yeah, aventura remember him it's like chitty bang bang chitty chitty bang bang yeah, there's so, something on the wing, something. Oh, I can keep nice. going all day. I, I know that, <laughs> unfortunately. Okay, but something that is cool. <laughs> I just want to keep going. I know you do. Just come out. Short flag redemption. Go! Go! You're out of here. Okay, I'll stop now. Okay, so something like you were moaning about the oh, yeah. load. No, not the oh. speed over this. The back of the, the load bay the load bay but it's got a roller cover that uh, is now automatic. controlled by your car key see that's pretty cool but that also cool. only on this fancy pants one i can't imagine that's on just yeah. your amarok no it's not normal amarok no 
Pan Americana. But I just want to have that bucky so I can tell people what the name of my bucky is. And it's quite cool. Pan Americana. What am I doing? But it looks very like it should have been like more like Desert Storm or something like that. It should have been like Pan Americana. They have missed art. Storm Trek. Storm Trek. Storm Trek. Like a trek. Like a trekkie. Yeah, no. Like a trekkie. Like I wanted to say a trekkie. And then a tracker so it's like trekkie. Two in one. But look. One thing I don't particularly dig is this lovely gear shift over here. Like it's just weird. It's, <laughs> it's very, very bulky. And initially to like, like you're looking for that knoppy, that mm -hmm. lever to kind of change gears and it's like up here and it's just like a weird positioning for it. It, it makes sense once you're on top of it and you snap it in, but when you yep. go from the side, it's like there's nothing to push in. And I'm going to be like hello sort of. Well, I wouldn't say it's going to be sexist, but I'm going to make a comment oh. between sort of male, female vibes here. In all in people, different people, is that like, I got to crash first. Um, I've got really small hands, so for me this is, mm. it's a <laughs> gear leader. Whereas yeah. like, you know, sort of one of our colleagues just now is sitting here, like it's normal, it's fine for mm. them. For me it's like irritating. This colleague sitting next to you. Do you have mass hands? Yeah. Okay, but I have tiny hands. That is good. Sure, that's got tiny hands. What's how are you? Eight. I'm literally half your foot. Half. I'm a four. <laughs> anyway. I don't know if I should be offended by that, but I kind of am a little bit. <laughs> Interesting conversation. Yeah, it is. Anyway, these oaks are eight. Back to the Amarok. No, I'm happy with most of it, but pricing, we don't know pricing yet, do we? Yeah, but maybe by the time this video comes out, we will also, we'll obviously, put, like put a it in Yeah. I'll be interested <laughs> to know what it is because like it's going to have to be aligned with Ranger, which we're driving next week. To get Entry that. level will be yeah, just under a bar, and then this and oak then, will be oh, one point three, three, two, one three. Point two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a very educated guess. Yeah. What do you feel about this discrete, which is also in the Ranger or the Ibero? Yeah. I mean, I get it. I know, but like, it doesn't then differentiate too much does it look at that look quite cool firstly when i saw like press images i was like Ehh. but this looks cool i like it i forgot that there are people coming from that side they normally do like i well, always stop and they're all taking it you don't like a bucky but you drive like, like a, a <laughs> drive like a bucky drive Apex, the peak of South African motoring.